hey my lovelies welcome to another vlog i know it's been a long time you guys have not seen us over here i mean it's been months now but things happen just know that things happen but you're wondering i still have not gone back to work or anything like that i am still at home and um going back to work i don't know when that will take place for me because it is what it is i've grown to accept what the condition is and that's that so just to update you a little bit because i don't know where this vlog will take us today i had vlogs from hurricane burial and apparently you guys will not get to see those quite a few vlogs i got everything on while it was going on and it would have been nice to edit and post it however it was on my other phone on my samsung phone and the phone crash and all kind of something happened and that just happened the other day you know so i'm like oh my god i have so many footages footages footage on that phone and they're all gone first what happened was that the screen was not working properly it inked out and then i got the screen off amazon and as soon as it got fixed then the next day it crashed i'm like no for real because why i even got the screen is just basically if you transfer the information and anyways i'm not gonna beat up myself over that what's gone is gone so that's why i mean like you know since us them vlog they did upon the phone from when let me just start fresh start vlogging back in real time don't bother take it back months you know months ago because yeah just live in real time well what should I say when it comes to my illness? When it comes to my illness, guys, um, I can say I'm improving, but it is still slow. It is very slow. Uh, I'm starting to wean off the medications because, you know, I was taking a lot of medications. My medications, um, I think when I started out with Tramadol, I was taking like the Trama set, which was like the mixture of Tramadol and Panadol. And I was taking 37.5 milligram per day and that was good for me then it increased to like three times daily and now i'm taking tramadol like i think i'm taking 300 i was taking 300 milligrams per day so that's 100 milligram in the morning in the afternoon at night that's how bad my pain levels were and it's not a bit of roses being on those type of medication because it does a lot to you and it was just not tramadol, it was pre gabalin or sometimes gabapentin. I didn't like them, especially the pre gabalin they make me feel like zombie and uh, puzzle flock and yeah, medications, guys. I was on a lot, and uh, truth be told, these medications, along with the sickness, it caused brain fog. So for me. You know, getting up and taking up a camera and smelling and all of that. Um, putting down the camera is something else because there are days that I don't feel like getting out of bed. There are days that I'm very snappy. I'm very moody. Um, I forget things easily, like very easily or like very easily. Like I feel like <laughs> there are times I'm like, oh man, I feel like an old person, you know. Not that being an old person is bad, but in terms of being so forgetful and the moody part of it so my family has you know learned how to deal with it somehow I guess Susanna understands it I don't know how much mama understand that I'm moody because of the medication so whenever it happens I try to be by myself or something but there are so many bursts of emotions at times that I can't even control and there are days that I get up, I feel like just crying, just crying, not because of pain, but because of the feelings that happen, if you get what I mean. Right. So weaning off these medications now, that's another thing too, because being on medications for long, so being on the medications for so long, you can't stop it abruptly because withdrawal and all of them things that will take place and it does a whole lot to you. I tried the first day I tried like I started like taking the 
the tramadol in the morning like 200 milligrams still and then in the afternoon i tried to skip the afternoon dose and in the afternoon i was like i didn't know where to put myself i was fidgety i was mom i felt like crying i just felt like i didn't know where to put myself i was just overwhelmed with a lot of emotions and i'm like wow i'm gonna get through this you know it's not the pain it's just what it is doing to me emotionally and that was just too much but you know i got any medication i couldn't bear it i couldn't bear it honestly so i realized that maybe i need to try a different approach so what i did the following day i took two in the morning and then one in the afternoon so i realized that i'm like okay I feel all right one day because you have to, you have to take time with it, you know, people take time with it. One in the afternoon, and then later in the evening, I take another one. I'm realizing I'm going through the day all right, right? So I continue. No, I try one per day, not one per day, one at each shift. So one in the morning, one in the afternoon, and one at night. So hopefully. I'll be able to go to one in the morning and one in the evening and then one and then just none at all because to be on these medications long term, it's not a good thing. You have to think about your your liver and all of them thing there because, you know, they mess up me, mash up your organ, and them, your liver, your kidney, everything. You understand? Mash up your brain too. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, yeah, so that's that because so, a lot of times i didn't really talk about the emotional aspect of it or maybe i did and don't remember who knows <laughs> yeah but that is the reality of it and i'm just being a little bit vulnerable when it comes to that because there are certain things that i wouldn't share openly about the condition itself right but it is what it is um i'm so happy that the pain levels are not as bad at one point the injections they became oh my god ex excruciating i was feeling excruciating pain i couldn't tolerate them anymore so i decided to give it a break and there were other interventions being used right along with the medications but that was happening for quite some time but i realized that the other interventions were not as effective because i was going into spasm a lot and there are days I, I feel so heavy. I literally feel like I'm, I'm weighing like 500 pounds. Like it's hard to take a step forward. It's difficult to get out of bed. And it was just very hard. So I had to make up my mind again and prepare myself mentally to start taking the injections. And again, and the minute I started taking them again, I realized a big difference. I'm able to move around freely. Um... I feel like I can take on the world. And that is one of the things too. You see, anytime I start feel good, I feel like I take on the world. And that is where my problem lies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think if I was a lazy person like that, I would get better a long time. But because of how my brain set, me always want to do stuff. And reality is, if I continue like that, then I will never recover. So... Me just have to come to the point where say, shall we? You've been out of commission for a long time. You're sick. It is what it is. You're not able to manage certain things. Yes, it may seem simple to go and put some clothes in the machine and all of them stuff. There, it's not hard because it's a machine washing it. But the bending and this and that. By the end of the day, me mash up. Me mash up like, whoa. If me go in the town, I have to come back. Just to go in a junction or something and come back home, me mash up. The last time I've been in the town was, um, let me see, during the time it was back to school, around August. And, you know, I was preparing for back to school rather. And I'm telling you, me and Tyler went, Tyler and I went, and by the time I come back home, me mash up. And what did we do? We stopped at a few stores. We stopped at a um, restaurant because it was quite some time that we did, really didn't go out and sit and eat together. And I wanted him to have that. So we sat at, I think it was Shazap or something like that. And we enjoyed the food. But by the time me come back home, me mash up, me mash up, mash up, mash up. And me have to say, well, if going out, if we eat, 
simple stuff like that and if you do look out back to school shopping or something may come back and feel so then it shows you so that means i have not really left the house like that yep and um even the other day shanissa invited me out shanissa if you're watching i'm sorry but shanissa understands what it is like i had to I, I I had to I had to put it off. I said whenever I'm feeling better, then I can go and you know link up with her and them thing. But for now, real reality of it is that I can do a lot of stuff. That's what I'm doing differently now. Even though the pain is not as bad, and I'm weaning off the medications and stuff, the big thing now, me not need to go take on one whole heap of stuff. Right, that is that. So that's what's been happening in my life and how me take up camera this morning, me don't know. Why me take up camera this morning, say me go try to do something. Because I feel bad, say me not getting no content over there, you know. Feel bad, 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 bad. But me say probably if me start off a little thing, because remember, so we are taking it easy. So I know big vlog on our get and I know um, our vlog and them thing there with different, different kind of, you know, footage like, you know the stuff them where you don't have to depend on the road and them thing. They're not them kind of vlog that you get. If me go no vlog, I would have mostly talk. Me sit down and talk too, you know. You know them kind of stuff there. Because me can't go do much of the different, different scenery and them things there. But me don't know how today I go go because me I try my best not to get too many clips. So that it's not going to be too long. Watch ya. You see how my, my finger them don't even keep out the camera. You know what that means? You like my nails, people. <laughs> I did them yesterday. They're press on. And boy, I was having a warm time. Because, I don't know, the glue just keep on sticking onto my finger. But, yeah. So your girl says she want the nails. Because she want the ASMR videos for her. What you call it? Because you guys, if you're following me on Insta on Perfectly Her, you'll realize that I, I post over there. And that, that's because those videos are short, like a minute video or so just to um, promote my business page. So, yeah, you'll see like package with me videos. And I like the ASMR videos, like, you know, when they tap on the bottles and stuff like that. So I wanted that if they can. That's why I did the nails, people. Because my show no never yet see me in the nails. And I guess mainly because I'm nursing, I never really do up nails like that. So, but. I mean, in my younger days, I used to. Because, I mean, there. Yeah. Susan and I said, I'm going to go sure. Go sure. <laughs> oh, boy, I feel proud of myself. But, so, I'm going to get out of bed now. I think I'm going to brush my teeth, build my skin. And, by the way, I'm on a weight loss journey, too. So, we'll see how it goes. So, let me get up. 15 minutes, me day at talk already. Whole of 15 minutes. Because I don't know, say, the talking still the day. That long gone. So if anything else gone, me still chat plenty. Mm -hmm, I'll do that. So, later. So, later. fresh now so I'm about to comb my hair but before I get into the combing hair thing just want to show you this lip gloss that I got from Revlon got it on Amazon and that made a tab out the topping sound people yeah <laughs> anyways yeah so let me try if I yeah I'm gonna try mm -hmm. look at that So, you know, I love the natural color and it feels so good on my lips. And it's long lasting too. That's what I love about it. Because it's any time I film a video them, especially for the business page. Look here, my, my lip them have a eye up first. That's the most I will do because, you know, your girl don't wear makeup that much. So from the other day, me just have this obsession like with the the lips, like how to do your lips properly. Because me, me just normally put on like a lip gloss and go as you know. And sometimes me probably not even put it on good. So I got another set before the Revlon one. 
probably it was about a set, a set of 10. I got them on Instagram. Um, what's the name of it again? Kerry Cosmetics um, on Instagram. So she sells wholesale lip gloss and stuff. So this was like uh, 10 of the lip, lip glosses for, was it $3,950, I believe. So I wanted different colors. So as you can see, I got these. And I'd also gotten a brown looking one and a clear one, but I can't find them right now. So I'm going to keep five of them for myself. I'm going to give five of them to Susanna. Right, so this is the one that I wear a lot when I'm doing the vlogs. You know, maybe I should have, um, wipe off my lip and try it on differently. But no, unlike me, I tell you, not this one me use mostly. This is the one I use mostly whenever I'm doing the vlogs, so. So. I love this one. I mean, it's very hydrating, I can say. However, it's not as thick as the Revlon, you know. It doesn't feel sticky. And as I say, it's hydrating. I wouldn't say it's plumping though. It doesn't give you that full lip. It just remains the same, you know? But I use this a lot. So, and I thought that that price was, wasn't bad at all. So, I mean, if you want to start a little lip gloss business, I don't know, you can buy it over there. I think I said it was $3,950, or the 10 of them. And then they have different deals where they have them in tubes, like the squeeze tubes. But I prefer the one with the one where we can do my little thing, right? So, I'm okay, I want to go over there for no ones. Right, so let me get this out of the way. I'd also got a pack of uh, lip liner because. I mean, I plan to do the the lip combo, you know, when they put on the lip liner and, you know, and the different shades and stuff. I just love to see it. Like, for example, Nara Smith. You know, so Nara Smith, um, lip them pretty. Oh, gosh. Pretty, 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 pretty. But these came off a of sheen, and I don't know what I was thinking when I got this pack from sheen. See? You're not really seeing nothing. That's your thing. Yes, I'm only this. I mean, I know what I did by this. So this is waste. So, why I bought it? Because it's the multicolor. And I mean, it's a lip liner. I mean, I think it's a lip liner. It's supposed to be cheap anyway. So, the price on there was probably about $3 or something. So, I got this on Amazon. It's a drawstring here. It's 16 inches. Because, Mr. These days, sometimes I can't bother with no wig and them thing there. I mean, I've been wearing my natural hair a lot. But sometimes, you just want to fix up some look away and... This is Brazilian, you know, it's feeling very soft and it's light and it feels good. It's human hair, right? So you see they, they clip them in there and thing like that and it's easy to go. So I got the combat gel, guys. I did, you know, I don't know if I know, keep up with Ashley on TikTok. The combat gel lady, she's a soldier and all of that and she sells her own hair gel. As you know, as soldiers, they have to keep like slip backs and stuff. So she started out that way doing her hair and then people would ask what kind of gel she used and stuff. And then after that, she just found her own hair care, hair care line and now she has the gel. And it has been described as thick like your mama, like very, very thick. And it keeps your hair like slayed, like all day. So if you want a slick back, then the combat gel is the way to go. So this is like, how much ounce this? This is 16 ounce. So the jar is fat. And this is strawberry. I paid $19 something. So call it $20. Uh, watch for me, can I use fuzz nails? I want me to go on my head, dear lord. Watch me now. But I can tell you, it smells very good. It smells very fruity. Mm. So they have it in different, different um, scents. Because um, on the website, because you can go on the website if you want to buy it. But the website ever sell out. 
and they would have like blueberry, strawberry, mango, watermelon, mahogany. And I really wanted the watermelon, but the only one that's available, the only one that's available on Amazon is the strawberry. And I mean, I'm okay with strawberry, but what I can tell you, it really smells good, guys. And this is real thick. Look, yes, it says something, something now move. Thick like your mother. So we're going to put it to the test because I want to see how this work out because this is a 3000 dollar in Jamaican. Yeah, 3000 dollars in Jamaican dollars. And I don't think it's a bad price for what I hear that it does because the amount of eco gel me used to buy. Uh, eco gel how much now? Wanna tell me. Right. Go try the front first and see. Because you know the hair growing out now, right? So it want to perm up. Feels good in there so far. I want me put the brush. I don't know I'm going to comb here. I'm going to have the brush here. So. One of the reasons for slicking back to I have a video to shoot for my business page later on. Too, so might as well. Me just go and do everything now so I get in the mood. Because, yeah. Oh, brush the right here. So. I'm going to make Susan a try this because I think this would be nice in her hair. You know, because she has natural curls and she always had her slick back them. So, I care some good hair. Make sure you try. Mm -hmm. Double the elastic. And then I just have to find one little something there back. Right? So let me put this on. Okay, now I cut that out there, blue. Okay. Just feel like handicap with the with the nail them. See, because a long time and I don't have something here. You want to see me when I answer the message them on Instagram? <laughs> you want to see me? Hold on, there's much clipping of this. I don't know why I think it's a wig I put on. Just one at the front. One at the back and then draw. And draw. Well, I forgot some. I used to do them holy pass up me when I did much younger. Every little minute, I used to wear a drawstring. It was one of my favorite go to styles. You know? I used to wear a drawstring a lot. But the one them with them I make out here now. When I see them make no good one again. Now I get the grip of it. Yeah. So. Ooh. Talk to me nice because I can do my hair. I hope I have one toothbrush right here so if I don't lay my edges them. So the brush will have to do for now. See there? How it lay it back and make it nice. And I see that. And I see that. How oh, many of you talk in the string? But the gel feel good in my hair. I not tell no lie. It don't feel sticky sticky. And the hair slick back. I mean, if you want more slick back, you can put more gel. But I mean, I feel like me want no more gel in there, to be honest. Because you can really slick with it. Like, really slick, slick, slick. But this is slick enough for me. And the hair is giving the hair nice. How much do pay for the hair? Like, $30? Mm-hmm. So I mean, you go to style this, so I go see me in this all the time. All right, so this is the outfit, guys. I just wanted to show you how it actually fits. What do you think? My belly is actually going down. I mean, it was really banging the other day, but I feel like, yeah, man, I feel like never on it things. I feel like I can put on the clothes and belly in a gansu and back the gansu and go back down. Not true. You know if you the belly gone down some, some more, mama? Is it? You think the belly gone down? You know what? You got to take off no more. You mean by me not to take off no more? You want to take off all of you yet? No, not all of it, but we need to lose weight for more than one reason. Remember. How much you think me lose, sir? How much you lose? Probably cover five pounds. 
I mean, I think, no, as a matter of fact, I, mean, I think we read 5 4. Yes, but I am a very big girl. I'm shocked, you know, and see the condition there, I thought, boss. Are you saying? For my condition, I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, I love me and I mess up me now because she ever had the same weight like like yeah. say if you take off weight you're not going to look good that's what she's saying let me tell you the family yeah, you're not going to look good but you have you have you take off more the family is already yes but me still yeah, big you can take off more but me sure so me still probably the 180 something same way me no, yeah me can't wear 180 me can't wear 180 you take off yes Eh, what is it? You don't want to go to the car. You are right, let's say. You don't want to go to the car. No, my belly won't go down more. You have everything. You have everything. Yeah, mama, you don't see belly in front of me? You don't see a belly in front of you, sorry. Like what you have belly, you have a phone call high. You don't see a belly. If you want to, if you take off your more phone, you can look on. So, oh, 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 oh you might me say it, you know, see it. You can't take off no more. We have to say I take off no more. Where are you about to take off again? Your belly, all right. Where belly there where you have in front of you? Your belly tough, man. You can't go down a little more. Your belly, I will go to the other end. But me, I say it's not just to they look good or whatever. It's to me muscle them. You know, just this. You know, 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 Fata look good. That is how they are trained to think that look good means that your fat are round. That's what they associate with look good. So if me lose certain amount of weight, then she will complain. I can't tell you. When me the much younger one time, me lose weight. And you know what she do? She never go up on the road. She tell me to mad to go up on the road, and then she she start blowing up on holy produce like pumpkin and you know what you call it. Um, top of Jenna and them thing there so that me can fat and put on weight and thing and uh, fluffy. You hear me I tell her that they, they know, like no, I want to lose weight. I don't know if I try to lose weight for a win. And it's not because I just for the looks of it, you know, it's for my condition. I should not get that. She still not listen to that part there. You know, say me losing weight is good for my muscles. Yeah. You understand? For my muscles to be toned and, you know, for me to feel good in myself because I get tired easily. So the weight is not good for me. You understand? If you have muscle problem, weight is not good for you. If you have pain, and the weight is not good for you in general, anyway. And we all know that. So I'm not going to get into the, the intricacies of it. But, I know that once I mention it, it's a trigger word for her. She don't like to hear about that. She's very conscious when it comes to that. So, from the other day, I did mention it to her. And you come like, you know, I hear you, you never even answer me. So you must know. But anyways, me, I'm going to try this one package now or something. I got some in the kitchen right now. I'm here for a fish. <laughs> I'm here for a mama for a fish. But I'm just going to show you. This is a glimpse. I'm going to full vlog like that. You understand? So, what you say you get my friend from Ira? Ira. No. Because she did plan to go alligator pond today, but it did get too late and she just died in their junction and get hand done. Because you can get nice quality fish their junction or my cousin sells fish too, but she never have none at the moment. So, right, guys. Yeah, a good day, that's the go. Yes, any amount of fish can be I'll let you know that they have been dropped in the room. Let me show you the fish there. What do you know? Grunt? No. Snapper. Snapper this year. Both my grunt. She's a grunt. Both my fish. Both my fish. Grunt. Sometimes the grunt and the arm snapper look alike. You can have the pink snapper. Snapper is. Right. So. Snapper. So she never decided to do a life fish. Them she did put back some of them because no, no, no. She got some um sliced fish. Susan, I love the sliced fish then. But the thing is, Mama cooked yesterday and I hope her food did it. So, I don't understand the fish frying business, but she ever cooked one whole it for something. But 
Try to shuffle on me. Okay, guys. So, it's later on in the day. It's after 3 o'clock. I don't know where the time pass and go. But for the most part, I told her that uh, maybe I would do a little sheen haul or something. I have a, quite a few bags going so. I probably wanted to do a try on. I don't know how it's going to work out because I'm pretty much tired already. And I'm mean, going to shoot the content for my business page yet. So I don't know what I really going to do right now. But before I do that, let me show you this pair of slippers that I got. Um, you know, it's like the Bridget style. At injunction at Palm style. You know, they I always are carrying around there. Um, it's around by Scotia Bank. Behind Scotia Bank, like you're going around. What you call it there, so Mr. Morgan. It's a big store and them sell everything around there. Um, shoes and clothes and stuff for the house. Everything. It's a big old place. And the people them around there are very, very nice. When it comes to customer service, I can't tell you them nice, bad. And I suppose I want to tell you about. So this, um, I do how much for it. Around $4,000, $3,700 something. So they near $4,000. And I got the yellow as well. And I also got appear for my mother i got the blue one for her and i got another one for myself but it's not this style i got it in black and those are lovely as well but me start wearing them there already but me not wear them here yet so me they want to show no. them pretty natural you have them in all colors and them stuff there so and different materials so me put that one side i'll show you what me have here so this is the sheen bag and these are got in the promotion promotion that sheen has this is the this is a bag cute natural it's a jeans bag and it comes with a strap i got another bag as well but see my mother they borrowed it so you know so that's not mine again so can't bother showing that in this hall yeah but it's pretty natural nice jeans bag Susan I got one of them as well so uh, and what I got guys is some bows I like the style of wearing bows but because you know that a, a trend right now but you have to know how to wear the bow them you understand you have to know how to put in the bow when it's appropriate to wear the bows but I like it so this is the black one show you how it look and a sheen it come from and it's free free something me get them in a people free free i think this one came in the under 50 dollars the 50 dollar they have a 50 dollar promotion where you get 50 dollars worth of stuff for free and how to do it go up on tiktok and type it in just type in sheen promotion jamaica buy one get four free buy one get five and you will see it come up and just follow the instruction because Mm -hmm. Just be kind. All of the girls them I do it nowadays. As me say, me do it quite a few times. I got this one as well, this creamish color one. And that's uh, the dress them when me get. Me tell you it I go cute to the bow. Cute, 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 cute my brood. So two of them. And let me get to them. It look like everything here. So I'll try on. Me really not feel like try on nothing right now. Can I show no instead? No, I show no. One next haul, no way. Um, one next haul, I will try them on and show you. This is a dress. It's a long dress. Oh gosh. I promise. Next video, I will try them on and show you guys. So I did a round for myself. No, not one round. Put a round for myself. Do it with Tyler. Do it with Mama. So this is a pair of pants you know this fits so nicely all right let me see what else maybe a couple of jeans and about to tell me to get up and try them and come in and get up <laughs> what the who am i doing this pair of jeans it's still bad me should i try them on show them not show people i know i know i'm um I'll be rambling about it, but I'm going to try it on for in my next vlog. It's another pair of jeans. I love how this fit me. fit me nice. These are stretch jeans. And look, look here. Sheen's jeans, them good people. Don't sleep on them. Them really fit nice. This hug up my body. This make me look really sexy. Yeah, I like it. My mother got the black in this one as well. And... 
and the amount of blouse and something get over there. The amount of top. This is a dress. I dress it. I love your dress. It's sexy in there. Let me know so I have to go try it on. This is a long dress. Because I don't know. See the real style. Let me dress back this a bit. No, no, I have you put on my face so far. Long dress. Nice bad. Um. So I need to tell them that I have something here. A little bit on up with pay. Because we know how to do it. Like sometimes you check out all seven dollar, you pay ten dollar. Then we have how much items. This is our white blouse. Mm -hmm. Nice blouse. Nice, nice piece of things there. What is that? You know, some nice stuff that I don't even remember what you ya? Oh, I like one blazer top. This. You see how this nice start to me now. And I'm telling you, the material of this stuff feel good. It's not like it feel like flimsy and them thing there. No, it don't feel like that. This feel nice. I love this. And you know what happened? I didn't, I'm not going to show you all of them because guess what? Some of them they already washed because me they plan to wear them. They're not wearing them yet. But I mean, when they wash, you put them in a drawer or something already. You understand? So I keep at this because I said I want to look a haul with it first. I want to do TikTok video and YouTube video. So. So you know how it goes. It's a, it's a suit, a pants suit. So I have the pants, black pants. Yeah. And oh, a message me there. Maybe I message me on the phone. And the top. The top is really nice as well. What is this? Oh, another dress, a blue dress. I get things, let me tell you, I get things, girl. Or this is a blue dress. And this fit really nice. You can wear with your, your, your arm belt around the waist. And it's pleated at the bottom. It fits me nice. Oh, the rest of them there. They're supposed to be a white dress. Look like me not care of that. Look like these are all the ones that I've gotten. That I took up with, with me. But there was a white dress and it was small for me. And I say I need to fit into it because I love that dress so much. And there's a green one and another one. So I really never took up a dress there. Because there's quite a few dresses for the bed, you know. But as I say, I'm going to show you in another vlog. Right, guys? And um, comment down below if you don't want to see them. Because the haul they make can just do the, the video there. The vlog they make can just do a haul. Just get up and do a haul straight. Right? So, like up the video. Um, share it out. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And I'll see you in the next vlog. Until then, I'm your girl, Shawi saying. Thank you for watching and peace out. Bye guys.